Today we're going to show you how to add a product to WooCommerce uh, with multiple sizes and colors. So I'm on the main dashboard of WordPress. I'm going to go to products. And then I'm going to add a product. And just for the heck of it, I'm going to add the V8 again. This is going. This is obviously a PFD, so we're going to add a, to our PFD product category. And we'd put some sort of description in here. And I'm just going to paste some standard dummy text in there. Now since this has multiple colors and size options, we're going to need to change this to a variable product. And then we're going to need to add the attributes. So the first thing we can add is our colors. And so let's go with red and black. And we are going to use them for variations. And they're visible on the product page. And then we are also going to add some sizes. And let's add Oh, large extra and small. We're also going to use for variations. And now we're going to save it. So we're going to publish. You could also pick save as draft, which used to be this in this button area right here. And that would not show it yet. So now we're going to go to our variations. So the easiest way to do this is to just click link all variations. That's going to build a color and size uh, option for each one. So if we link all variations, so it's added four because we have two colors, two sizes, that's four products. So then we would enter our SKU in here, and that's uh, their 09 something, V8, and this is our extra large, so I'm just going to call it XXBL. We would put in the stock we have, if there's a special price for it, there's a sale price. Now if you don't add dimensions or price or any of these items, it's actually just going to default to our general settings right here. So we've added our SKU in there. Remember all of this general stuff will actually populate from, uh, from your imports as well. And so then we'd add it for, so this is the 09 V8, this is the red, or what do we do, we did X, XX, R, we gotta do 09 V8, X, S, B, L, O, 09. So now we have them all in and we can update. So why don't we view our product? Let's see, we have our product here. We could red, and that would show our items. So if we want to add a main image to this, we'd add our featured image. I'm just going to go into the media library, but you can upload them any other way you want. And I'm going to look up our V8 image. So there you go, I have a red one right there. And use it as featured image. Now and hit update. You can see that I have my main image in there. 